Hey, Dana here, and welcome to my blog. And this is Daily Trades. Well, this is the second one. This time, I didn't have to make up for all that commission that I paid the first time. And it just happens to be the same stock that um, I sold the first time. This was this was fantastic, and I didn't I didn't even notice it until I I checked checked it today. I checked it about every other day, and this is Friday, October sixth, and I had set it um, this particular stock. I had set it um, originally. Um, the first time it sold was at um, was it ninety. Ninety-one dollars, and um, from what I bought it at, I made a fifty-four dollar profit after all the comp on the first time around. I spent forty-five dollars um, accumulating it uh, at that point, and this time. Um, when I so when I sold it, I turned around and I waited a couple of days for it to go back down, and I bought it back up, and I only bought I only bought I only had to pay the five the five dollars uh, commission to buy it, and then I set it at its peak, and I sold it at ninety. Yeah. I had set it at like 91, yeah, 91. I had to pay, again, 45, $45 in commission the first time I, uh, I was buying it, and then I had to make that up, you know, I had to subtract that from my profit. So uh, that was a big gain, and then I went ahead and bought it back up with the profits, even though the stock, of course, was leveled off at a higher higher price than when I originally bought it because that was that was a dollar or that was under a dollar when I bought it and then um, I didn't even make the I didn't even make the main peak out of that uh, okay yeah it was a dollar 95 from but anyway um, this time around I'd set it for where it peaked when it ended its its rise on the first time I I sold it and it hit and then uh, I had set it for three dollars and fifty cents this time because that's where it it had peaked uh, the last time I sold it and it hit it hit today it's been when did I August third August third is when I bought bought it again. And uh, this is Octo uh, October 6th. So it's been almost a month that it's been sitting where it did and it peaked again. So um, this has been a great profit on this, even though, you know, I could have left it alone all this time and just sat on it and made a really big profit. But I wanted to, wanted to yeah, you got to do what you got to do. So... Um, Anyway, uh, I made I made seventy two after after the comp, five dollar comp. I made seventy two dollars off of it. So total profit on this particular stock um, has been a hundred and hundred seventy hundred twenty seven dollars, and uh, that's getting really close. No, not really. Um, I can't say that. I want to say it's getting really close to the total comp that I've spent on all my <laughs> all my stocks, but not really. It's about half. It's about half now. So what I'm doing right now is I'm going to set the peak again at 350 because that's where it peaked again. So now I'm going to wait a couple couple days and uh, watch it watch it drop back down to where an average. I'm gonna find. I'm gonna remember what the average was when I bought it, and then I'm gonna set my sell my uh, my buy price at that, and uh, uh, let it set, and uh, that's where it's gonna 
that's why I'm going to keep that at that at that rate. So there you go. Um, and I did buy again this week. I did buy some more stock of another company that was um, and that hit. Um, I set I set it I set it where I wanted it, and um, it took a couple of days, and uh, it hit. So now I've got uh, more of that stock as well. Um, I find myself setting it where I want to buy it, and uh, I haven't um, I haven't gone right in at that morning and bought it at whatever what whatever the rate was. So uh, I don't know whether that's locker or, or what, but um, I just I decide I'm not going to buy it at what at whatever the rate is uh, when it starts out that day I want to I want to start five cents um, about five cents below whatever that whatever that rate is when it starts that day and uh, let it set all day and see if it doesn't drop to uh, to that level so anyway thanks for watching don't forget to comment I'm not a uh, I'm not a professional broker anything like that this is just my um, this is my life's um, venture in uh, day trading at the moment so I may eventually go to penny stocks but uh, right now I'm just slowly investing uh, I got seven companies right now that I'm investing in I'm gonna I'm gonna move it to 10 and I'm gonna leave it I'm just gonna concentrate on those 10 and my goal is to retire from my my day job um, in July July 1st of 2020 that's my goal and uh, between doing these videos and um, doing the stocks that will be my income after that uh, when I finally retire so right now I'm just building up my stocks and then uh, that's about 33 months. Yeah, 33 months from today. And uh, I kind of looked at it like, uh, what did I say, 11 quarters. <laughs> so uh, that's where I'm at. So again, thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment. And we'll see you again on day trading.